I'm gonna say in all the places I've ever been, this is the first time I've seen a no seance sign. Pretty cool. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this short little video, just kind of looking for the Flatwoods monster. So we are going to check out the Flatwoods Monster Museum here in Flatwoods, um, West Virginia. Shortly after 7 p.m. on September 12, 1952, Edward and Fred May, along with their friend Tommy Heyer, saw a bright object streak across the sky and land on the property of G. Bailey Fisher. Later, they would go to explore to see what this object was, along with Kathleen May and her three sons. What they would discover would change Flatwoods forever. In the pungent mist, they saw a man-like creature with a red face surrounded by a pointed hood. It had claws for hands that made a screeching noise. This was the first sighting of the Flatwoods monster. Flatwoods restaurant. Flatwoods, the spot. What it's called, maybe. The restaurant after the monster, right? Let's go. We're in the hills of West Virginia to go to Pennsylvania, but that's besides the point, okay? We're here because the flat the Flatwoods monster was here and he was in the woods over there. And we have to find him. Let's go find him. Alright, let's go find the Flatwoods monster. Why don't you turn on your light, dude? You can't you can't find the monster like that. We'll we're turn it off. Flatwoods monster. But we're gonna walk into the Flatwoods and see if we survive the Flatwoods monster. We won't. And if not, at least we had a brownie. Yeah. All right, let's head into the woods. Here we are. We're coming okay, up. It's a, let's just call it a scream, okay? Is this the trail? If you heard a scream out night in here, just imagine being out here and hearing that. That would be insane, right? It would be insane, but you keep suggesting that it's now. Oh, yeah, I think a scream. And I think we have established that it was actually an alien monster. Oh God, this is actually kind of scary. We're out here in the total darkness. This is literally pointed at my face, but you can't see my face. Yeah. It's, it's very eerie. What is that noise? Beautiful camp in Flatwood, West Virginia, but we have been plagued, which what I can only assume is the curse of the Flatwoods monster. When we first pulled in here, um, the hitch, uh, setting up real quick, we had a phone call. I rolled up on my levelers. I got everything set up, put the chocks out and everything, put the jack down, unhooked from my pro pride, and um, pulled forward, the trailer rolled. Almost came off the block. Then we'll, so we went to eat, came back, um, went inside, and the camper was on fire. Um, smoke, horrible smell, looked around. It was just wiring shooting, and our panel had caught on fire. Then this morning, we hooked up the sewage, and uh, I'm gonna run the sewage before we leave the camp with full hookups, because we're not gonna have them for a few days. And that's when, for the first time ever, I had a failure of a sewage hose. Um, so, I think everybody knows what that means. Oh well, the curse of the Flatwood Monster can't be denied. And the main moral from this video should be that if you're in like some small town, don't just like think that it's nothing because it has culture and its own culture and everything. So you gotta like get into like the local legend and experience the town for what it is. Like, I'm not even joking. Of course there is. Oh my god, I hear it. Oh, 
Do you hear that moaning? 